Hey, I'll just make it a very quick video to give you a guide on how to carry out the Cryptic Quatrain 2 quest. It's pretty easy. You want to start off by heading to the star chart in the helm. Grab yourself the medium treasure beacon from the rank package. You'll only get this when you hit rank 10. So you're going to want to rank up pretty quickly in order to get it. Next thing you want to do is head to the Dreaming City and do the Bay of Drowned Wishes Lost Sector. Now, if you don't know where that is, just drop in in the usual transmat zone, turn around and it's right behind you can't miss it you want to go in clear the boss and loot the chest that's going to give you the next step the quest line you're going to want to head to the edz and the next thing you want to do is finish the lake of shadows strike at any difficulty the next step happens after you beat the boss what you want to do is you want to go into the expeditions playlist found in the helm and do any mission in that playlist with a sword equipped once you finish the mission it's off to nessus now you want to go to two spots in the cistern location. The first one is this massive tower here. You want to climb up these steps so you find the pyramid shaped door and on the inside of the door you'll find the first dig spot. Once you've hit that dig spot you'll get the last step of the quest. What you want to do is head north towards the massive Vex Radialaria waterfall and look for this like smashed up sort of sphere on the coastline. Right next to that you'll find the dig spot and that's the end of the quest. This is also how you get the second part of the crude cipher and that should give you you a new treasure map for the captain's atlas i haven't done that step yet when i've had a chance i'll let you know how it goes thanks for watching a like would be really appreciated if this helped you out and if you're still looking for a guide on how to get started in season of plunder i got you covered too hit the link on the screen right now see you later